view set because the new Mid-America above uh, Sputnik if you'll just sit right there we're gonna slip right over here and you are looking at boy Tony who kind of stunned the wrestling world when I, you gotta figure it was an upset he beat Tracy Smothers and is now the Mid-America heavyweight champ take your glory because you're the one that's got the belt that's exactly right Lance Russell one picture's worth a thousand words, isn't it? Just take a look, everybody. I am the new champion. And I said I was going to beat Tracy Smothers, and I did just that. I'm going to continue to be the champion for a long, long time. Well, we uh, hear the comments from Boy Tony. Now, exactly how long you're going to have that belt will be depend on whether you have to get by, whether you can get by Tracy Smothers. Remember, there's a return clause in that championship. So ultimately, you're going to have to meet Tracy again. I will be ready when that time comes Lance Russell I will be prepared for Tracy Smothers. Okay boy Tony and we're gonna have an opportunity to see him in the ring we just will go ahead and get it and uh, go with the second match right here in this first set before we take let's just uh, take a break let's just go to the ring and we will be ready to go with our second match of the day this one is going to be a one fall 10 minute time limit bout and across the way, wrestling out of Memphis, Tennessee, is Mike Murphy. And his opponent in a non-title bow with one fall, 10 minutes in time, at about 235 pounds, wrestling from St. Louis, Missouri. Boy, Tony, the Mid-America champion, your referee for this affair is going to be Jerry Calhoun. I would have to agree with you, he is a little strange in his attire, Sputnik. The last time I seen a wrestler with a gold purse, it was uh, Cora Combs or somebody. It sure wasn't a guy, so I... <laughs> I, I, uh, I better bow out of here. I never seen anything like this. It, I, I'm not gonna come in here, you know. I, I hope you don't, don't on TV. <laughs> That's a true. Spudding Monroe, you gotta believe we'll be seeing a lot more of him before before the tour is over with. And look at Tony going after Murphy. He reached out to shake hands with him, kicked him in the midsection. Murphy fell for it, took a thumb from Tony as the referee trying to get in a position to see him. Look at the nice reversal from Mike Murphy. Boy, Tony, again, the referee this time sees him, jumps in and says, watch the thumb. Big upper arm. Well, that's almost too much to take at one time. Sputnik Monroe and Boy Tony back to back. I tell you, I think you're absolutely right. Uh, Sputnik uh, with his son Bubba making uh, an impressive debut here. And had no trouble getting the victory. And uh, Boy Tony, uh, he mentioned uh, in an interview we had with him a week or so ago that he had had a, a total change. The, uh, the old Tony, Tony Falk, uh, who almost never won a match, had changed, and sure enough, now this guy comes back in here today, and he owns the Mid-America title. You know, one of the things we said, though, Dave, when Tony Falk was his name, and he was losing match after match, it wasn't that Falk couldn't wrestle, because he could. He just made so many dumb mental errors that he, 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 would, he would have a match won, and then he would blow it and end up getting beat. Time after time, time we after saw him do that. And uh, that's apparently changed, at least so far. Mike Murphy trying to battle his way out from under that face lock, which I think had a little eye gouging involved in it. You know, I'm not sure boy Tony would appreciate it, but I think uh, boy Tony has put on about 10 pounds, too, since he was here last time. Yeah. He's coming in... Uh, a little heavier than the old 226 that he used to weigh. Well, it didn't come in his hair because he's uh, he's lost a little up there <laughs> on top in one of the more weird hair suits that I've seen on man or woman. It is a little strange. Yes. Mike Murphy back into the ropes and boy Tony slamming away, whip across the ropes. Yeah, in the air with a big power slam. Boy, that's something new to. Boy, Tony's repertoire, we haven't seen that in years gone by. One, two, three, and that's it. Yeah, two minutes, 43 seconds worth of it as uh, Boy Tony takes the victory. Two minutes. Wow. 
plus, and Boy Tony is the victor. We've got a little musical look at Boy Tony. Here it is. Hello, this is Boy Tony, and I want to give you a progress report on how my fan aid campaign has been going. You know, the contributions have been coming in a little slow. I've been doing the best I can with the funds that I have, the passion out, so, but it's not good enough, you know. I've got to get you to send your contribution in, and with your help, we can clean up all these dirty wrestling fans in this South. Now, I guess you're wondering what boy Tony is doing standing here in front of his show. Well, I realized that it just wasn't good enough just passing out soap because a lot of people out there don't know how to use it. So today, I'm going to tell you how to use soap and I'm going to show you. Well, see, it's like this. When you get the soap in your hand, you have to activate the soap. So you need some water. Now, I realize some of you people don't have much running water, but creek water would do just fine. But you've got to have some water to activate the soap. So what you want to do is get some water on your skin. So you, you get under there, and you get it wet, and you take the soap, and you just rub it back and forth. And you see, this white stuff, this is lather. That's it. You lather this soap up. And you just scrub it back and forth real good. And after you get it lathered up real good, you just take it, stick it back under the water, and see how clean and nice that is? Now you do all the parts of your body. I mean, all of them. Just lather it up real good like that. Get under them arms. Just lather it up. Scrub it up real nice. And then take and get that water on it. And see how that is? You can be as clean as boy Tony. Just be sure to lather that sofa.